particular mathematics, it worked. I don't know about that preacher now. I ain't going to judge him. Who has marked his word and heard? Now you know it's got to be me. That's what he's talking about. Those who, and it, now listen, it even gets deeper. When you get into that word, you know, their own, the, the imagination of their own heart, when you break that word back down to the root, it's talking about poppy seed. In other words, some of them get high before they go on out there. Probably. I don't think y'all understand that. It's certain, it's certain denominations, it's certain quote unquote religions who actually become intoxicated and then they say they're prophesying and folks believe them. God, they don't come in my little bit uh, anointed the way you want to be anointed. You come in and get anointed by my Holy Spirit. I, I, I better keep on going now. I'll be doing it. Come on now. Listen, 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 listen. listen. Very important because too many times we let what some some man say. Don't believe every word out there. Check it out for yourself. Amen. Behold, this is what God said. A whirlwind of the Lord is gone forth in fury, even a grievous whirlwind. It shall fall what grievously upon the head of the wicked. I didn't write this. I want y'all to let that meditate. You need to look up that way in whirlwind and blow your mind. That might give you an idea of what happens in the natural. It's not because God wants to do it. What did God say? Your stuff. Mount Vesuvius blew up and they got all kinds of records of what happened. Pompeii. And they stick them folks still, knock all that stuff, and build around it, and stay right there again. Now, who thought is it if the thing go off again? I'm going to leave that long. Man. Just, just look who the thought. Why? The anger of the Lord, it's not, the anger of the Lord should not return until he has executed, until he has performed the thoughts of his heart. In the latter days, you shall consider it perfectly. So don't be talking about what God doing is out of order. See, we can't judge because what? We don't know all things. But, he, but what can we do? I'm going to stop right there. What can we do? Would you read that verse? We told, we got to grow. In order to be, in order to grow, these things have to happen. Read that verse somewhere. I got a few more verses to come, we, and we're going to come back 23 and finish that. If some stuff in there might curl the hell in the back of your neck that. You can read ahead. But read with discernment. God is not angry with you. Who did he say he's going to come down on? The wicked. So if you're not wicked, you ain't got no problem. What you must be doing, in other words, we must, the only way to grow is accountability, but what else? Read it, read it, read it. Read it. Ephesians, read it. The third chapter, verse 17. That Christ may dwell in your hearts by faith, that ye be rooted and grounded in love. What? you say? In other words, in order to grow, rooted, first of all, you got to be planted. What, what, what do you mean? Rooted means they didn't root out to break up that what, fallow ground. And, and you remember my sister was saying somebody would sow the seed. Uh, didn't y'all say something about that? Somebody would water it. But who ultimately gives the increase? God. Now uh, turn with me, if you will, to Psalm 92. I'm going to read rather hurriedly. We're going to deal with the growing. Next week, we're going to. We're going to lean in just a little bit on, on, on the love because if we don't love one another, hey, what, what's the highest thing God said on this earth anyway? Love. No. You're like a sound and brass and what? Well, I ain't going to go there yet. 92 verse 12. Listen, 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 listen. It says, the righteous, I mean those that are accountable to God, they handle their affairs in a credibility way with discretion, as it said in the Proverbs. Now listen, the righteous shall flourish like the palm tree. He shall grow, this is powerful here, like a cedar in Lebanon. And you, in the Bible it says cedar of Lebanon. 
the etymology of the cedar tree, them, so they got strong roots and they grow really In other words, you can look over at the, in, 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 of the cedars of Lebanon, the most coveted wood in the world. Or did they hear what the dog said? You need to read when David built. Uh, uh, what, what, oh, no, I ain't going to get that. I get happy when. That's what God wants you to be. But you got to be what? Accountable to Him. You got to be rooted and grounded. Listen now. Those that are what? Planted in the house of the Lord. What's going to happen to them? Shall flourish in the courts of our God. Oh, no. That leaves you from cradle. All at one verse covers a lot of time. Leads you from cradle to the grave on up to him. And he said, you've been what? What we hear all the time. Serving, you've been faithful over a few times. But he said, I'm going to make you rude over many. Now, if anybody can serve in the courts of the Lord, you're a bad dude. Amen. I understand that. Uh, no. Even in the natural. I'm talking about a true servant of God. I know a lot of folks say, well, I don't even want to preach. That's too much pressure. No, it ain't no pressure. If you get pressure, if you try to handle it, it's bad. Come on, somebody. And listen, listen. They shall, they shall still bring forth. Whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's something that you, you ought to make the things that make you go, hmm. Remember that old thing went around? Okay. They shall still bring forth fruit. What does it say now? In, in old age. That, that fruit covers a whole lot of territory. Yes, That's why Sarah could give birth at 90 years old. That yes. gold. And yet they can still stand boldly. Yes. Even when yes. you ever seen some of them mothers coming in churches on them canes, and you can't help watch them. You can't help them. But you know they live for the Lord. Every time I sit in front of my aunt, 103 months old, if she opened her mouth, some say, shut up and listen. That's exactly what I did. Because they have things that, that God have instilled in them. Even, even ago, they shall be that. No. Why? If, if you're willing and obedient, I say, well, what is that going to happen to you? You need the fat of the land. That don't mean you. It means all that I have for you. Eyes have not seen, and neither has it even entered into the heart of man. What God has for them that love him. Somebody ought to shout anyway. Yes, yes, and flourish him. Yes. Why? What they supposed to do? To show that the Lord is upright. He ain't got no time for no foolishness. You ain't going to be doing your own thing and say you, you, you're upright in the sight of God. No, sir, no, sir. You will only be forgiven for those things that you repent. First John. First John. No more John. No three. Is that three? Man, I think what it is. One of them. Is it? That's what it is. It tells you if you sin. What do you say you got to do? Confess it. That don't mean you got to go in no booth or confess it to me and then preach it. You confess it to him. And he says, I, I'll, no, I'm faithful and, and I'll forgive you. Even though if you just read the word, even if you are backslide. He said, did you read over there in Hosea 14? I love the backside. Didn't you see I'm going to bring all the y'all there? They got to lose some of them. And you're not going to operate anymore in the imagination of your mind. You ain't going to get high on yourself. You ain't going to get high on the foolishness of the world. You're going to hear my voice. If you reject it there, have a nice trip. Well, Lord, Lord. Listen. The Lord is up. What else is it? Mm. He is my rock, isn't your rock? Yes, he is. <laughs> Are y'all hearing God? Did y'all get excited? He, he, he is my rock. And there is no unrighteousness in him. Underline that. You ought to know that. But if, it, if it's no unrighteousness in him, that will be, to the best of your ability, no unrighteousness in you. Amen. But I, I can't, you're right. You can't do it, but he can Hallelujah, glory to God. And our job, our job as ministers, I covered this, I'll do it. Ephesians 4, start verse 11 through 15. I may not 